Well, hello, 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 good morning, Moramai, and welcome to the basement farm, here, down in Sussex. It is winter. That leaves us with, to be honest, not too much to do. Uh, we can see the temperature is currently minus three, that's going to be a bit nippy, uh, and it looks like it's going to be a pretty cold winter. Uh, today must be Wednesday, and tomorrow. so we're looking at, uh, well quite a while until we can actually do anything. Uh, the ground's frozen, that means we can't work on it, even though the fields that we got planted, six at the top there and ten down on the left a bit, uh, need fertilising. There's nothing that we can do about that right now. So, we will whiz through these days. I'm suspecting it's going to be one episode per day, unless something interesting happens. Uh, I think the first thing to do today is ooh, have a look at our crops. We've got 20-odd uh, of wheat going on there. What's that price is like? Oops. 8.41 at the windmill. That's not too bad. There are we on the left with a little green arrow, but it is going up, so I don't think we'll sell that just yet. And season's it is the high point of today, so I think the first thing I'll do is load up our trailer with uh, as much wheat as it will carry. We'll pop it up to the windmill to start with. Oh dear, that's not going to be... Uh, that's not going to be helpful. There we go. Good, and we've still got lots of flickering going on, but hopefully... Ah, oh, we go. That will do. Uh, load up as much wheat as we can, take it up to the windmill, uh, and then it's ready when the price peaks. We'll keep an eye on that as the day goes on. Uh, and then we'll come back, feed the animals, and uh, that will be our essentials done for the day. There we go. I think that's just about right. There's the mark on the floor. Let's go turn our system on. On. And fill up with wheat. And because that's all we've got. Now this trailer will hold eleven and a bit, so that's just about half. Um, so there we go. Price still ticking over at eight forty. So let's groove up there. Uh, the windmill is just across the road, literally from here. Just up there on the hill. So. It is but a short journey, quite a steep climb, but hey! And we will fill in any extra time we have today. Although that is likely to not be huge amounts of it. By uh, grabbing a mission or two, if there is anything available. Likely just transport. There we go. Windmill, but I don't think we'll sell it yet, as the price we're going slow enough may yet go up. Uh, it's still definitely the place to sell it. Come on, you can do it. Uh, and I think it'll stay as the place to sell it. So, let's just wait here until they stop talking in numbers. There we go. We'll keep an eye on that. Let's just run back down the hill. There we go. And then we can just dive onto the farm, sort out our animals, and we're good. We won't go in there. What does that say? Construction area. Well, I have nothing to construct right now. Maybe later, as we jog along the road. It's not even my house. <laughs> okay. Oh, still going up there, man. Right. Well, let's open this up. The sheep will need uh, water and a bale. Did I pop a bale in there? I did. We're ready to go. How exciting. Uh, our planting was all done, so that's good. Ugh. That is flickery. Let's be stopping that to start with. Or starting that to stop with. Who knows? There we 
go. We'll give the sheep a clean when we get down there. I can feed the chickens later on. They had certainly enough to be going on with today. There we go. fill you up. We've got plenty of water going on, so that is okay. Okay, so we'll head down to the sheep. See what's going on there. What I should have done, of course. Oh, that's where our spade is. What's it doing in there? I'm sure I left it down there. Was uh, plough that sheep field up. But now... It's frozen, and they can't, so that might lose us a, a fallow bonus, but we'll figure that out. Right. Not quite sure why I kept the spade in there. I think I might uh, pop down to the shop and see if we can uh, trade the spade in, because I believe... Oh dear, dropped it. Uh, there's a brush in the shop now, which is slightly easier to handle, but... Uh, going to have to wait until next time I'm there. Okay. Everybody done? Everybody done? Right. Let's tip that in there. Not that way around we won't. And see. Whee! There we go. Right. Go and put this down. We'll leave it where I weren't used to leave it because otherwise I'll just get confused. I'm easily confused. This much is clear. Right. Let's throw that in there. That should disappear. Which it did. And the sheep are heavily fed. Let's go and give them their water. Then they are good. What's happening on prices? Still going up. Everyone's a winner. Now let's try not to run over the spade. Otherwise I will have to go and get the brush. There's all your water, little guys. Magic. So, uh, in the off chance that the soil does, in fact, thaw out, uh, we will then get that ploughed up as quickly as possible. However, it's not looking likely. Uh, Okay, and excuse me for a brief moment while I just go and take care of something. Catch you in a sec. And we're back, precisely where we left off. Things happen. Right, what was I doing? I was going to check the price on the wheat. Which is still going on up there, so that's okay. Let's put these dudes back in here. Much better doing that backwards. And I may as well leave this tractor there, to be honest. But we'll leave it in the middle. Ready to go in case we need it. Throw another bale in there. Get ourselves ready. What I did discover in the shop was an auto-load trailer for these little bales. So next year... I'll make some fresh ones, and we'll get rid of that. Okay, price is still jumping around the place, so that's okay. Uh, let's see. Ooh, tomatoes. That's going to be tricky, given that we've parked our uh, wagon up there just waiting. Well, let's do that tomato one. Unless there's anything for our friendly fields. 7, 8, 9, 10... Field 11 still wants cultivating, but I'm not going near it. At some point, it's going to disappear. Right, well, we'll grab that transport job, and we'll go do that. I think we'll time-lapse that. Uh, I'll keep half an eye on the prices. Make sure I'm heading to the right place. Yes, I am. I'll keep half an eye on the prices if they decide to uh, top out, uh, well, we'll come back and uh, do some selling. 
Uh, but either way, I shall see you towards the end of Catch in a Tick. Righty-ho. Well, uh, just as you see me drop that pallet of tomatoes, but fortunately they didn't sploosh everywhere. Uh, check back in with the prices, as you may have just seen, but let's do it again. And uh, see that the price seems to have topped out. So, without further ado, let's get selling. Uh, which is quite handy, as then I can do the rest of that transport mission just off camera and we can be done for the day so we've got wait for it nine thousand from that trailer load alone well that's very nice we've got about the same to go I want to keep some of that crop back uh, to make sure the chickens is get fed They're going through about 500 a day, and it's quite a while off yet until... Uh, yep, uh, it's quite a while off yet until they can get a fresh crop going on. Maybe about 500 a day, maybe 250, but uh, either way, I think I want to keep a good 2,000 back. Uh, we can dive through this hole in this hedge here. So that should see us safely through. We can always sell any remainder next uh, next winter when the price is right. Okay, so what do we have left? We have, t call it 11 left. So I quite like this to go up to about 9, say. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 8, 9. Close enough. Leaves us 2,000 and a bit in the tank. That will do for now. So, we'll go sell this. Uh, and with it being winter, of course, the days are short. Anyway, it cannot be far off time to be snoozing. So we'll get these sold off camera. I'll finish unloading those tomatoes and then we'll claim the 
reward of whatever on earth it was, I don't even remember. And that will see us for today. Then we can have, hopefully, a slightly more action-packed game day tomorrow, but I wouldn't put a lot of money on it, because tomorrow is the middle of winter, so it's even gosh darn colder. Half a chance of snow, but it doesn't look like it on the forecast. So I think we will probably take that time to refill our stocks of everything necessary for next year. Go on, tractor, you can do it, buddy. There we go, made it. Yep, we'll get ourselves some weed killer, some fertilizer, make sure we're stocked up on seeds. Maybe get a bit of petrol as well to uh, keep in our garage just to get everything refueled and serviced for the winter. Tally-ho. And there we go. So, as that particular load of wheat finishes, it should help everybody in the area get their bread over Christmas. Another seven and a half for us. Uh, I will bid you all good day. Thank you, as ever, for watching. Uh, likes, subscribes, comments, always appreciated. Very much, Lee. And we will see you tomorrow game on Winter Day 2. Bye-bye for now. Bye!